Manfredonia grew up in Newtown, and while folks around town didn't care to be interviewed on camera, those who did know him say they never saw any of this coming. And Fox 61's Tony Terzi tells us about some interesting social media posts Manfredonia made in recent months. As a 2015 graduate of Newtown High School, where his mother is still a teacher, Peter Manfredonia obviously has strong ties to the community. So Newtown police thought it would be best to step up patrols. Newtown police say they've increased manpower out of an abundance of caution and that residents should be aware of what Peter Manfredonia looks like and be on the lookout for what they call a very dangerous individual. Today, we visited the Newtown residence of a person with the same last name as the suspect and were quickly shooed away from the property. And in checking on a property of another person with the Manfredonia last name in neighboring Southbury, police greeted us there saying they've instructed residents of that neighborhood who see any suspicious vehicles to call police immediately. On Peter Manfredonia's Instagram account, there are pictures of his association with two organizations that arose from the Sandy Hook shootings in December of 2012. August 15th of last year, he posted a picture of himself holding a cycling jersey and wrote, quote, proudly representing Sandy Hook Promise for the biking leg of my triathlon. Then August 19th, he noted he was representing the Aviel Foundation in memory of Sandy Hook victim Aviel Richmond, writing that he spoke to Aviel's mom and, quote, I can't thank her enough for embracing me the way she has, and I'm excited to continue the effort of preventing violence and promoting compassion. Then September 7th, a picture of him after having participated in the triathlon. And at the end of the post, he wrote, quote, excited for what's soon to come. I'm Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.